Legend has it that during the Qing Dynasty, Meng Tzu scholar studied hard for his imperial exams on a small island. His wife, who would bring him food, found that the soup would be cold by the time she had crossed the bridge to the island, and the noodles were soggy. She then decided to lock a large earthen pot with boiling chicken broth, with a layer of oil on top that would act as insulation and keep the broth warm. The noodles and other ingredients were kept in a separated container, and when she arrived, she makes the two containers for warm soup. That's a region of the crossing the bridge rice noodles. After three hundred years of inheritance, Yunnan crossing the bridge rice noodles is now a national intangible cultural heritage of China. This famous snack originated in Mengzi, a small city in southern Yunnan, China. Known as Mengzi crossing the bridge rice noodles, in Mengzi, people of all ages and both sexes have a particular fondness for crossing the bridge rice noodles. There are many ingredients in crossing the bridge rice noodles, and the production process is rigorous. Soup often needs to be stewed for about three hours. To keep the chicken soup warm, a layer of oil has to float on top, and the ingredient tray is even more exquisite. Place raw chicken breast and pork rind on a plate and cut them into thin, transparent slices. Soybean milk fuel, scallions, cilantro, etc., are prepped and served on small plates. The order in which the ingredients and side dishes are added to the soup has been carefully considered when serving. The first side dish put into the soup is an egg, which represents the wealth and prosperity. The second side dish put into the soup is fresh meat, which is a symbol of good luck. The third side dish is cooked meat, which indicates everything goes smoothly. The fourth side dish is chrysanthemum to pray and wish you longevity and auspiciousness. The fifth side dish is soybean milk foam, a symbol of auspicious signs and blessings. The sixth side dish is peas. Which signifies all dreams come true. The seventh side dish is bruised ginger, which means seven star is shining and bring you good luck. The eighth side dish is vegetables, blessing the prophets pouring in from all sides. The ninth course with tribes in it, meaning that your family friends have got your back. The tenth course is served with rice noodles, which expresses the idea of perfection. That is the only way to make an authentic boil of crossing the bridge rice noodles. Family 同胞来到蒙自，必须要来，我们一天可以品尝一套清真的过桥米线。蒙自过桥米线已有三百多年的历史，那我们开店以来一直传承的最正宗的过桥米线的做法。呃，我们希望能够让每一位顾客都能品尝到最正宗、最传统的蒙自过桥米线。